Another thing I've been working on on the AGT today is the NeoFetch editor. I've added a line here, some distros have their own configuration. That's one thing. And the dot config NeoFetch config dot conf, I think. And they could have also their own application. So investigate, that's one sentence that matters. Uh, for instance, on, on Archcraft, I believe, on, on Amos. So some of them have their own beautiful NeoFetch, right? That's one. Two, um, use small ASCII has been changed. And the best way to do that is probably going to show in the images. There are a few and it's um, up to you guys. And who are the guys? The guys are here. It's up to these 14 guys to ensure that there is a small ASCII NeoFetch. So you have to create it yourself and put it on the GitHub of the NeoFetch uh, developer. And Arclix is okay, Arch is okay, and Manjari is okay. And I'll show you what the small images are if I can find them. This is one of them, right? So Manjaro has, if you use for small ASCII, they have something like that in NeoFetch already. So it's something you need to create yourself and put it online and give it to the developer. And then with the click of the button, basically it's distro underscore small. And then the system knows, ah, I should show you a small one. And Arcolinx has one as well. I'm not sure if this is the guy. Yeah, that's the guy. So if you're on Arcolinx, sorry, on Arcolinx, uh, then this is the normal logo. But if you would like to have less of all these lines, and then there's also this small Arch Linux. It's a question of clicking here, normal or small, and then you are split into basically NeoFetch and user bin NeoFetch. He'll take the Arch small. So if yours not in there, get creative, get cracking, right? Create your own small NeoFetch and submit it to the GitHub of NeoFetch. All right. Cheers.